This is just one of many castles that one, we're gonna visit, and two, that there are in Okinawa. There's tons here. And welcome back to another episode of Oki Up Close. Today we're at Nakagusku Castle, which is only about 20 minutes away from uh, Kadena Air Base Gate 1. And um, it's this beautiful castle ruin that we've just been exploring all morning. It's been super great. So the castle was built in the 14th century by the Nakagusku King. Uh, in 2006, it was put on Japan's top 100 castles. So for this to be on the top 100 list, I feel like it's pretty cool. Yeah. Gravel is not my friend. I've hurt myself many times. and we actually have a special guest. We have Muddy Gregory here. Hi. And um, she is actually the one behind the Okinawa Cafe Journal Facebook page. So about a year and a half ago, we arrived in Okinawa. And it was, my older kids go to school. So it was just, you know, she was three at the time, three-year-old Sayla and myself. And we started going to little cafes, little cafes. for lunch and just for our little mommy Sayla day. Time, mm -hmm. yeah. And then we started discovering all these beautiful gems, and um, I wanted to be able to share that with all the Americans who live on the island. So I opened up the Facebook page, and um, it kind of blossomed, I guess. Took off. Yeah. Everybody loves it. Everybody loves it. <laughs> So we just finished up eating our delicious lunch with Madi and Sayla and we wanted to invite you guys to come out and enjoy all of these cafes around Okinawa. You can do that by joining Madi's Facebook page, Okinawa Cafe Journal. Okinawa Cafe Journal, it's been a, it's a journey of this little girl and me going to different cafes for the past year and a half. There are so many gems hidden across the island. There's 77 cafes on there right now, so make sure and check it out and get out there and explore. Yeah. Thank you so Thank much. You much. Thank you, Sayla. Thank you for having me. <laughs> So we're here 
here now at uh, Katerin Castle Ruins, which is about 20 to 30 minutes away from Kadena. But it over to the right is actually White Beach, and it's really close by. Um, so Katerin and Nakugusku Castle actually have a direct correlation with, with each other, and it's pretty interesting to hear. Yeah, so actually the two castles and the kings of each castle had a bit of a rivalry going on. So um, depending on where you get the story, you end up getting two different answers as to what happened actually in the end. So one story will end up saying that the uh, Nakagusku king sent assassins to kill the Katsuden king, but the other story it will tell you that, uh, that the Katsuden king killed himself. And I mean, you'll, you'll get different stories, different areas of, of the island, which is kind of interesting, you know, you kind of write your own history in that sense. Um, but this is a really cool area just to kind of see a different part of the island, essentially. Just got up, something's wrong I waited up with wounds on my feet Where will you be? Flickering through memories The Polaroids yellowed in the sun Longing to be seen So come and hide Castle Ruins, head over to Kadena ITT, and if you don't want to drive to any of them, they'll drive for you, so you have no excuse. So in the meantime, get out, explore, and, and see Oki up close. close.